Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to another wonderful and interesting video tutorial. Here I'll be showing you how to remove spots or pimples here in coral photo paint. Alright, like I always say, it's very simple and very very easy to do. Okay, before I proceed, if this is your first time visiting my channel, do all to hit on the subscribe button. Turn on post notification bell to get notified whenever I upload new videos. And um, if you've been an active subscriber, thank you for always engaging in our video. Alright, um, so let's proceed. First of all, we'll head on to Coral Draw. Alright, um, this is the interface for the Coral Draw 2020. And um, this is the image we'll be making use of. And um, we'll be attaching this. The link to download this image in the description box below so you can try it out yourself all right um we'll be taking off this red spots on this lady's face in coral photo paint i'll be showing you quick and easy way to do that all right um to do that you first of all select the image then you go ahead on to the menu bar menu bar this area then select bitmap from bitmap head on to edit bitmap then you wait for a little while then you check your tax manager that is below here then the coral photo paint app pops up all right so this is it so let's increase this all right you come here the standard bar to fit then you go to the menu bar here, object, create from background. Then you notice this boxes appears around the image here. Alright, so what you do next, you head on to the tool section here, you select the healing clone tool. The shortcut key is um, zero. So just press zero, whichever one. And so you zoom. I think we have to increase the size. So you come to this area, let's say 120, and hit on enter. Then um, as you can see this it's a circle with a plus sign in the middle. So um, this is what it does now. You right click to copy a particular portion of the image, and as you can see, a duplicate is created. So this duplicate um, contains the portion of this image you copy there so it tells you to paste it here as you can see the blemish is gone and um, this is what the healing clone does it fixes imperfection by painting with sample texture that matches the color of the surrounding area just like what we did here all right so we just let's undo that so you copy and you place it you replace it until it matches it okay let's undo that ctrl z same thing applies here let's right click then let's click to paste all right all right so long as it blends we are okay with it as you can see it's very okay so since like there's no need to pick game because it um like you said here it fixes imperfection by painting with sample texture that matches the color of the surrounding area all right so um the the portion of the image you picked here matches the surrounding area. so we'll cover it with this as you can see it tallies very well all right so cover this one too so i think this one we have to reduce the size let's say 50 and hit on enter and right click to copy and let's click to paste until you are satisfied by the end result right, so I think you are done so you come to this area then so 17% as you can see all the spots on the that was on the lady's face has been taken off now but um using the healing clone to which the shortcut key is zero right um this is the most reliable tool i always use to take off 
um, spots or blemishes or even pimples on images. Okay, um, here's a quick tip. Another tool I would also recommend, but not up to this um, healing clone tool is um, the clone the clone tool itself. The shortcut key is C. Alright, so let's increase the size. Let's see 100. And hit on enter. So this is what it does. Copy pixels within image areas to cover imperfections or duplicate image areas. So let's undo one control Z, control Z. Alright. So this is what it does. Let's right click. Then um once you've right clicked, then this circle route or plus sign in the middle pops up. As you say, you should paste the portion of this image you've copied. It is not as accurate as that of um, the healing clone tool so that's why i wouldn't recommend it though it works on other maybe vector based objects so i think um this should be the best here the healing clone tool here so let's um, do that okay I think we'll have to make use of the healing clone too again. Then I'm um, so right click and copy to cover. Yeah. Just want to show you the whole process that is involved. You can see everything is nice. Wow. So once you're done, you come to this area, click on this or you con or you click on control plus S, whichever one. And you notice this area here all right so don't forget this is color photo paint so once you're done you minimize it then head back to color draw and um, the spots the red spot that was here has been wiped has been taken off all right hey okay, guys um that is it on how to remove spots blemishes or pimples on an image here in coral photo paint but you can only see it's very simple and very very easy to do all right guys um if you find this video helpful do want to hit on the subscribe button like our videos turn on post notification bell comment and um share our videos thank you for watching see you on the next video tutorial